this problem, if x equals two times cosine theta, we're gonna write the expression two theta minus tangent of two theta in terms of just x. For x equals two times cosine theta, it is x over two equals cosine theta by dividing both sides by two. For the cosine equals x over two, we can use the function and its inverse property as the inverse cosine of x over two equals theta. Now we have theta in terms of x, gonna set it aside. Next, we're gonna use the relationship of the three sides of the right triangle diagram to form the trig function based on the cosine theta is adjacent over hypotenuse. Then the right triangle that we're gonna use with an angle theta, adjacent is x, hypotenuse is two, therefore the opposite is gonna be two squared, which is four minus adjacent squared, which is x squared. The problem asked to write the, the expression two theta minus the tangent of two theta in terms of x, since the delta and the, the angle theta is already found in terms of x, so that term is done. Now we're gonna work on the expression involving the x for the tangent of the two theta. The double angle formula for the tangent is two times the tangent theta divided by one minus the tangent squared theta. From the right triangle diagram, the tangent theta, which is opposite over adjacent, opposite is square root of four minus x squared divided by adjacent, which is the x. We're gonna use that to replace into the formula of the double angle of the tangent function. So two multiplied by the quantity square root of four minus x squared divided by x for the numerator divided by the quantity one minus square root of four minus x squared over x quantity squared. You have complex fraction. Try to avoid the complication by rewriting the division as the multiplication of the reciprocal. But before we do that, we're gonna write in this, in this format. So two times square root of four minus x squared divided by x for the numerator, divided by the quantity one minus the power two of square root four minus x squared is four minus x squared. Make sure you write in the grouping symbol, divided by x squared. And next we're gonna simplify the second group or the second quantity here. Rewrite it as one single fraction so one as one over one, the common denominator is x squared. So we're gonna multiply top and bottom by x squared. Then this expression, so now I'm gonna rewrite it as two times square root of four minus x squared divided by x divided by the quantity x squared minus the quantity four minus x squared with the common denominator x squared. The numerator of the second group can be simplified to be x squared minus four plus x squared or two x squared minus four. Now I'm gonna have to use more room here and we'll come back to this expression eventually. Right now we're still working on the tangent of the double angle. So the tangent double angle, now we have two times square root of four minus x squared divided by x divided by the fraction form as two x squared minus four divided by x squared. And then rewrite the division into the multiplication of the reciprocal. 
So 2 square root of 4 minus x squared over x, no change, multiplied by x squared divided by 2x squared minus 4. I'm going to put parentheses around here. Just make sure we don't get things messed up. Next, we're going to simplify. We see x and x squared reduce. The 2x squared minus 4, the common factor is 2. So we have 2 times x squared minus 2. We see 2 and 2 reduce. The simplified form of the tangent double angle would be 1x left here. We make x multiplied by radical 4 minus x squared for the numerator divided by the quantity x squared minus 2. Now, we got the expression to represent the tangent of double angle and the expression to represent the theta. We're going to have to put them together to finish up the problem. Summarize what we did. For an angle, theta is in the form of the inverse cosine of x over 2 and the tangent of 2 theta is in the expression x times square root of 4 minus x squared all divided by the quantity x squared minus 2. The expression that we're going to have to replace in terms of x is 2 theta minus the tangent of 2 theta. The theta is the inverse cosine of x over 2 and is subtracted by expression in x for the tangent of 2 theta or the x times the square root of 4 minus x squared all divided by x squared minus 2. Now we have the expression just in terms of x for the 2 theta minus tangent of the 2 theta.